Hello boys and girls, welcome back. And yes, we made it to three episodes of Tiny Town VR. Yes folks, sorry about the delay. In the video, my headset was not was not being a good headset. It was glitching all over the place. But now we can actually get the job done. So I need some like dark grass for this. If you are wondering what are we building today? So we have campers that get overrun by zombies. Now who are the campers you might be asking? The campers are grandma and grandpa. Those are the wrong people to take over. Those are the wrong people, I think, to invade. Yes, this video probably will be like 30 minutes. I'm sorry if it is. Because we got quite a bit of building to do today. I'm sorry about that. I understand if you're not going to be able to watch this whole thing. Because it's going to be a long episode. I'm fine with that. As long as you enjoy the episode, that's it. That's the only thing I like. We're going to have to deal with that for now. Oh, so we need to like big trees. So we need like big trees. Like bigger than big trees. Forest. Maybe it's in the farm. But I would doubt so. Oh, I could have put those down. That's cool. Right. What is, we're just gonna do, we're just gonna deal with what we have to deal with right now. How big are these trees? Not very big. We're, we're gonna deal with these trees. Right. But what we're going to do, we're going to mega size them. Like, make a mass of trees. Kind of like how you would see in a forest. Yeah, we're going to do that. Kind of like what you would see in a forest. Like, those big, tall trees. See, I can shrink these a little bit. They're all going to be different sizes, so. So these, but these trees are like... Some of them truly are not your average trees, like over there in the park. Some of these will be massive trees. Just a little bit. And we're just gonna place them in all different areas. Like, like this. Shake you. Put it over there. Take you over here, like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm moving. I'm not. I, th I thought I was, like, I thought I was placing that. I don't know why I did that. <sighs> I like it. My head is a lot smoother than what it was. And like, of course, we'll have some like smaller trees like that. Like, like I said, like what you would find in like a forest. Right here. So like, so like, so like, what kind of tree would you like find in a forest? Sometimes, massive trees. We're just gonna lay these out in different places. We're gonna we're gonna make you a little bit of a bigger tree. Comment down below. Do you, do you guys want a tour of my main city that I work on? You guys want a tour of that? Holy crap! Oh my god! Why are they so big? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Game's breaking a little bit. <laughs> the game's breaking a little bit. Game's having a little break. I don't know why those trees are so big. As you can tell, we're just littering this place with trees. Yeah, we don't need that. Oh, the hard thing is like pulling out. We got quite a few trees. But hey, you can never have too many trees for a forest. Maybe you 
can, but you know. Woo. Just had lunch, so like this tree will like shrink it. God, this snapping is ridiculous. Put you like a little bit over here. How's the forest looking? So if we were like, well, I like it so far. I'm gonna place down a couple more trees yeah a little bit bigger place you like crap fudge but this they'll be like littered with the fur on like big trees and and, and, then, and then we'll have a couple like medium sized trees so like, so like we'll have like one like one, like one small one here in the corner. That. Okay, I think we've got enough trees down. <laughs> in my opinion, so now we need like a tent, which I don't know if there are tents. But we just have to search. I think they would be like camping. I mean, I think. That we would. No, we don't have any tents. Hmm. It's weird. Well, we might have to go custom tents. We'll have to go custom tents then. Using the primitive things. We'll have black tents. Actually, no. No, we're gonna have gray tents, actually. Make some custom tents. Make it. Make it stack. The tents won't be as accurate. They won't be as accurate as normal tents. But hey, we're, we're, we're not gonna do that. Would I turn, please? Would my game mind turning? Because I don't want to turn. Fine, I will. Oh my god. And, and then we'll cover it up like behind here. Make it stack. Oopsies, come get that tree back. So there's a tent. Uh, not the best. What the, did that go? Did that go in between? Not the best tent. But it's a tent, they both are in. So now what we need to do is put some good stuff in there. They will have some axes. Now we can turn snapping off for this. So you know we still need it on. We'll get toilet paper. Oh, wait, let's burn to this. We'll say toilet paper. I need a lot of toilet paper. They stacked the toilet paper. I don't know why they did, but they did. Um. Do they have like beds I can use? Maybe. Not too sure that. Hey, skibbity dot dot. Maybe. We'll use these. Oh, but we'll like shrink them like that. 
We'll shrink them. So they sleep right like like that. They sleep together. But today they're not sleeping because they have to fight. What they did, they brought their own trees. And they wanted to like fit in. So they brought their own trees. As like a door. So they brought, they came in the area where they hooked up with their trees, but in a smaller area. So they can feel at home. It's cool. Oh, okay, those are pools. That's cool. Um, what else can I use? That'll have to work for now. Right, time, for some, for time for our grandma and grandpa fighting. So they're fighting. Stepping off. So they're fighting. Grandpa is doing his good old deed. And grandma just punched. Just punched. Just punched his arm. Boo! We don't need big grandpa. Grandma, I mean. Just punched a zombie. We're gonna go zombies. So we'll have zombies that are like absolutely infesting. Yes. Like this. Kind of like this. So he just got punched. So he just got punched in the face by grandma, as you guys can tell. As you guys can tell, she just got punched, which is not ideal for a zombie. And then over here. This zombie is being whacked in the head by grandpa. Now, for some reason, they're not using their hatchet. Actually, never mind, grandpa is. Grandpa is smart in this situation. He brought out the axe. Now, we need them items. Like a cane. That's what we need him to use. Because he's old. Not offending old people. Just saying. That's a golf group. Whoa. You know what? The golf club will do. So he whacked the zombie in the head. As you guys can tell. He went full on whack a mode. Now he's looking at it like old oh crap. She's got a hammer. A hammer that will fight. How does this look like back here? Like, from our last video. It's kind of funny. Back to the zombies. This is where we have to like place all the zombies. Like brains, give me death. <laughs> now as we know, zombies are clumsy. Zombies are clumsy. So he tripped over one, uh, the, the big tree. He, they probably should look at yeah. it. This zombie said, I came in like a wrecking ball. But he might miss.
just a little bit because the zombies are dumb. Now, of course, like how I did in there with the zombie in a tree, we will have another zombie in a tree. Yeah, zombies in trees, zombies in trees. You said I'm gonna do something like, 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 like there's always like a zombie in a tree. Like, come on. But this time, this time we got another zombie in a tree. Zombies in a tree. It's a zom it's a zombies in a tree moment. Zombies in a tree. There's zombies in a tree. He is smart. He wants to kill the grandpa because he is their most enemy. But what's he using? Let's see. He's, he's he's smart, so he's using a weapon. That's one thing. He, he he's definitely using a weapon. He's using a baseball bat. He's using a baseball bat because he likes to be smart. In his other hand, he's holding a baton that he stole from a police officer. Cause you know he was able to steal something from a police officer, so he is gonna be going all out and just killing Grandpa. Coming with a zombie right behind him. Who is also holding something. Two things. What's he holding? Let's find out. What can he be holding? He's holding money in one hand. Because he thinks that will do something. And... He's also holding a banana. Yeah, so he's holding money and a banana. Well, we will have this. How about this? We will have somebody behind them trying to take Trying to take the money. We'll have somebody trying to take the money instead of helping them. Because, you know, people are greedy like that. We got a clown running out of the forest. Full speed. Two bats in his hand. Because you know, clowns are like that. So we gotta go get those bats. He stole, him, he stole it from kids. That's how he was able to get the bats. He stole them from kids. So yeah, we've done good so far, but we have a little bit more to get on to. And this zombie is down because he got bonked in the head by bandages. Who threw him? Let's see. Who can help out that threw it? Big over friends. It's like, yeah, buddy. It can be a group of two. But yeah, buddy. It's like, whoa, wee. It's like, whoa, wee. Good job. I act normal instead of helping them. They're just, they just want to have a little bit of fun. No, and I think we will have him. him Holding a gun, hiding in a tree. Yeah, he might not be feeling very well after that. Mm. 
pistol and he just hanging out, he's probably gonna fall. But it's fine, because that shall wrap this episode up. What an episode we had today. <laughs> oh my. My legs hurt after that, but what we got through today? Them being attacked. And people coming out but not helping them. Maybe they kind of helped him a little bit because they kind of hit the bandage over his head. But yeah, that's going to wrap it up for this episode of Tiny Town. Uh, if there's anything else you'd want me to do, please comment down below because I ran out of ideas. So comment down below. What do you want to see next in Tiny Town? Thank you for watching and I will see you all next time. Peace out, everybody.